We're really on six shoes right now. You know? Six. Carrie's on a six shoe, bro. Six. That's actually mad when you see the whole journey. Six. Because six is not a small number, especially in the signature shoe realm. Six. I'm proud of Carrie, it's man. It's crep. It's a lot of crep's your name. That's your yeah, crep. crep. And no one can ever take that away. Nike made these and is now part of Nike Kyrie history. Facts. That's so mad. Congratulations. Six. That's so wild. Six. Yo, what is up, you two? This is Pure Kicks back again with another performance review. And in today's video, we're taking a look at the Nike Kyrie Sixes. Ooh. Let's get it. Yeah. First and foremost, massive shout out to the family over at Pro Direct Basketball. If you would like your pair of the Carry Sixes, click the link in the description box below to the Pro Direct Basketball website where they will indeed take care of your basketball needs. But of course, before you do that, don't forget to like, comment and subscribe. Like this video, show your support to your boys. Comment down below your thoughts on the sixth signature Kyrie Irving shoe. And of course, hit that subscribe button and the bell next to it to get notified every time we drop a new video. Yeah. The Nike Kairi 6s. Yeah. We're really on a sick signature shoe, bro. Yeah. And it's a long time coming. Very. Yeah. Six years, in fact. Six years. And the dude right now is hooping. He's now mm -hmm. officially a Brooklyn Nair, obviously, as you Come guys all know. And the way he started the season off, bro, it's a complete madness. And this shoe is also somewhat of a complete madness. So without further ado, Let's just get straight into it. Firstly, looking at our favorite part of the shoe, the support. Comes to surprise, or maybe not, the Carry Irving signature line has been known to be a great supportive shoe. Thanks. Especially for guards. One of the best, one of the best. And this shoe follows suit. We have all the usual suspects and then some. We have the external heel counter with four foot cables and the return of a midfoot strap. We haven't actually seen this since the two. Since the two. Since the two. Welcome back. Yeah, it's been a minute. Welcome back. We appreciate you. We also have the outrigger shape for lateral support. And obviously the midfoot cut shoe, which also provides that extra support as well. So it's all going on, bro. It's all kicking off. Yeah, man. Did it do its thing? 100%. It's going to do its thing. Like yeah. we said, one of the most supportive shoes for guards, if not the most supportive shoe for guards, it's been consistent across his line. And we literally see everything we've pretty much ever needed in a supportive shoe. Yeah. With the midfoot strap being back, we get a full lockdown pretty much across the shoe along with those cables. The outrigger shape helps us with that rolling action. The coverage in the midfoot top helps with the ankle coverage. And we're just pretty much taken care of from all angles. And you really yeah. feel completely locked in yep. when you lace these up, 100%. Bro, I'd even mention that how the traction even comes up. We'll talk about that we'll more get when, that. when we'll we get, get to the that. traction. We'll get to that. We'll get to but that. obviously the traction crossovers and that, you're good, you're covered. Covered. You're covered. Any movement, you're good. I think with everything mentioned, my only gripe is that maybe it's teetering on the kind of the line of being maybe a bit much. Mm. There's a lot going on and it may feel a little constrained. Is that the right word? Yeah, yeah. A little yeah, constrained. Yeah, I, hear, I hear what you're saying. You know what I'm trying to say? Yeah, I hear what you're saying. But it's good. I'm still enjoying it. I'm happy yeah. to be locked in, especially when you're doing moves like Kyrie. So if we're talking a score, it's a 9 out of 10. It's a 9 out of 10. Team. A 9 out of 10 for support. One more thing I'm going to mention is the mental support of course. that the strap provides. You actually do feel a lot more locked in. And we all know support has a huge mental aspect as well. So the carry smashed it for sure. Next up, we have the traction. Now here at Pure Kicks, we're calling this the multi-directional all-seeing eye traction pattern. I know you see me see you. Thanks, yeah. <laughs> on the all seeing eye attraction fan, we also see the Sydney Opera House inspired, which I haven't actually seen since the Kyrie one. Now, actually, when I saw these <laughs> announced, this traction pattern, I was really excited to see how they performed. <laughs> and they performed. <laughs> They performed. Yes, they did. Really, really well. 100%. The multi-directional did its thing. To be fair, I wasn't surprised. This is the Kyrie we're talking about, for goodness yeah. sake. And it always has done its trick. In this case, they're super deep grooves. It's kind of blades throughout. So yeah. I'm going to make up the all-seeing eye and the Sydney Opera House that we see in this traction pattern. And it bangs. It bangs, bro. I enjoyed it. I'd even take these outdoors. Oh, most definitely. Because of how thick and deep the grooves are. Yep. So you're good. 
Dusty courts, you're good. Yeah. Clean courts, of course, you're good. Yeah. If you're good outdoors, I guess all that's left really is, is the score to me. Make it a nine. Or make it a nine. You're going to make it a nine. I think so. There you go. It's a 9 out of 10 thing. Like we mentioned earlier, the 9 out of 10 traction actually helps with the support we were talking about a second ago. Yeah. Traction being so good helps with balance and helps you just stick into the ground. And again, going back to that mental support, when you can stick to the ground this well, you're just going to be fine. Yeah, you're going to be good. You feel well. supported, you feel balanced, you feel like you're going to do some Kyrie things. So go do some Kyrie things. Next up, cushioning. And we are so happy. We are, happy. We are over delighted. Happy. That four foot zoom is back. Oh, happy day. Oh, happy day. Oh, happy day. Oh, happy day. When four foot zooms. When four foot zooms. When four foot zooms. When four foot zooms, wash my sins away. Oh, happy days! Oh, happy days! Oh, happy days! When four foot zooms. <laughs> <laughs> Cut it off! Four foot zoom is back. It's here to stay. And not only is it back to back, it's Nike Zoom Turbo. Tell him back to back. Hello. It finally feels like Kyrie is understanding the full benefits of four foot zoom. It's good for you, bro. It's good for you. There were some dark days. Yeah, there were. Once. Kyrie two. No, oh, no, one, 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 one's a four foot. One's a four foot. At the tiniest little, tiniest little unit. And then you thought, you thought they change it to the twos. Change it. Twos, threes, and fours. Were well, some dark days. Very dark. There were some dark days. Four walls weren't too, too bad. They didn't have push logs. Exactly. We can't get into that right now. However, four foot zoom. Turbo is here in back-to-back -back shoes. How did it feel? It felt amazing. You can feel it straight out the box. Straight bro. out the box. Your forefoot is fully taken care of and it just felt the way it's supposed to feel yeah. when we're talking Zoom. Yeah. Of course, the Zoom is accompanied by a file-on carrier, which is actually made a little firmer in these to kind of help with support in the heel. So that impact protection and that kind of heel strike when you're running. It's not as comfortable because yeah. it's more functional. Yeah. It's there again for support under you to take care of you on that side. So there's that aspect yeah. of it. Other than that, I enjoyed the cushioning for real. And you know what? The only gripe that I have of the shoe or with the cushioning, just in, in true Nike fashion, mm. they always give themselves a bit of room to improve. Yeah. You know? Why do we not have a zoom in, in the heel? I do not know. I can't tell you. Only Nike knows and only mm. Carrie Urban maybe knows. I don't think he knows. I don't think he knows him. There should be a zoom unit in the heel. There should be. But there isn't. Does it take away from the performance? No, not really. Not, not a lot. But Nike. we know what Nike has to offer and the fact that we're not getting it, it's a bit upsetting. That's it. So, I mean, we're a little petty. Yeah, we are. We're a little petty. Yeah. And for that reason, eight out of 10. Great cushioning. Great cushioning. We are petty, but court feel is there. It's there. Responsive is there, bro. Fully Response there. Response is fully, fully, fully there. You have nothing to worry about. Impact protection is there. It's there. To some extent. It's there. But it's just four foot zoom. You're missing the hill. Go pay, yeah. Go pay. Next up, we have the fit. Now, overall, the fit was decent. Yes. Okay. 100%. Let's talk about our gripes first. Yeah. The main issue came from the materials. We'll talk about more in depth when we talk about materials, obviously. Obviously. But out the box, the shoe did feel really, really tight. Mm. Snug tight, snug tight, tight. I'm trying to make if, a word if right. we're looking at that tight spectrum, yeah. If it's tight, it's on the and line. it's loose, I guess, all right, snug tight, yeah. It's between snug and tight. It's it? just over snug. I feel like it's, it's gone. It's, it's gone past snug. <laughs> Wait, and it's, just, it's, it's breathing on tight, like it's almost there, you. bro. I do hear it's you. Touching hairline, scratching on you. tight. Bro. I do hear you. That might just be a preference thing though. That might be yeah. what Kyrie's about, but we haven't really seen that throughout the line if we're yeah. talking about the rest of the line. I think I saw it a little in the five. Maybe the, maybe he's just going to love that. But again, it is a preference, it is a shoe. But for us, it's on that tight, tight level. Tight, tight level. See what I'm saying? It does fit true to size. True to size. And Can't be mad at that. You know, whether you have a narrow foot or a wide foot, don't worry, I won't grill you right now. You're all so good. I don't believe you. <laughs> you <laughs> thought it was coming, didn't you? for it. But the one thing I will say though is that once the shoe breaks in, it does feel okay. Yeah. 
One thing I also like is the strap. True. The shoe definitely does feel a lot more locked down once you strap in. Definitely. So, you know, that's a plus. But apart from that initial tightness, everything else is pretty good, really. So it's a decent overall fitting shoe. Pretty, yeah. Nothing special, nothing crazy. So all of that being said to me? So seven out of 10. Seven out of 10. Above average, for sure. Yeah. Job done. Next up, talking about the Matorals. Now here in the Kyrie 6, we have a brief mention of four foot. <coughs> <coughs> okay. Sorry, you, uh, breathable. Oh. You said breathable in my throat. Bre breathable is not right. Breathable is not right, bro. Oh. Breathable is not right. This shoe is not breathable. Okay. But it's still a mesh. We both read that online. Okay. We did. Yeah, we did. That's what it says. But is it? <laughs> it's not that. <laughs> Talking about the rest of the shoe. Now pay attention on this. This is where things get a little sticky still. All right. Yeah, listen up. On the black and white colorway, we have a pretty premium feeling leather it across feels the nice, back. Bro. It's plush. Yeah. It is buttery. All right. But in every other colorway we've seen, including the global preheat, it's a synthetic. I don't know if they'll all be holograms, but it's a synthetic. It's it's not for basketball. I don't know what it's for. It's not for basketball. What I can tell you is that it's not the nicest to feel, to touch, or even just even wrapping around the foot that leather though mwah. yeah but with all the information we now have it's looking like they might have more synthetics than levers hopefully they're only doing this with certain colorways and certain packs that they're bringing out and when we get the generic colorways that you know they'll all have leather in them or surprise us and put some planet in there i don't know if i'm Ooh. talking too much but uh, that stuff over there is tough bro we only have all the information we have and at this time, it's a kind of stiff, very, very not breathable synthetic. It's great to look at. Great to look at. Terrible to play in. However, they do do their thing for support. Yeah. Because again, going back to what we said about how good the support was, with materials this structured, it helps massively with yeah. keeping you locked in. So that's where the pluses are. But the gripes might be the breathability, the flexibility, and even the weight as well. Yeah. So overall, materials is a seven out of 10. Still above average because they do their thing with support, but they're losing a few things with all the information we have at this time. Yes. In time, if we find that more levers come in, and that premium touch, that premium feel, score happy go up. But for now, it's a seven. So looking at all the scores, the Nike Kairi 6 scores an 8.0 out of 10. We see you, bro. We see you, bro. And we are proud. Good job, Nike and Kairi. Six shoes in. Six shoes. And we're not disappointed. So you guys are doing something right over yeah, there. 100%. There are still a few things we have to talk about, some feedback, yes. But as you can see, there's a lot of good things we have to say about this shoe and of course your signature line so far. Yeah. They banned. So that is it from us. Massive shout out to the plug, AKA Pro Direct Basketball once again. If you'd like your pair of Nike Carry Sixes, click the link in our description box below the Pro Direct Basketball website where well, they will take care of you. But of course, hit that like button. Comment down below your thoughts on the Kyrie 6. Are you gonna copy a pair? Which colorway are you going for? What are your thoughts on the Kyrie 6 if you try them out? Do you like the leather or the other stuff? I don't know what to call it, is it 3M? It's a holographic. It's a holographic. Nintendo, I think I read somewhere. Do you mess with the strap? It's up to you. It's up to you. Comment down below. Let us know. There you go. And of course, hit that subscribe button and the bell next to it to get notified every time we drop a new video. Hey, make sure you hit that subscribe button, you know? And get notified. And get notified. And also, follow your boys, man. Social follow us on Instagram, Twitter, all them ting there. Follow your boys, because all them you never know what goes on over there. Why are we doing a little giveaway when we get to a certain number yeah, in that, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, bro. And then once. I'm pre the website. Pre the website. Pre the website. This is purekicks.com, yeah? Safe. So right guys, there you have it. This is the Nike Kyrie 6. We're pure kicks. Let's get it. Yeah.